For the first time in 30 years, Fresno City College is opening its doors to the entire community during their open house. Now, normally it's an event primarily for high school students, but this year anybody and everybody who would like to visit the campus can come. And here with all the details is Emily Slater. She's the College Relations Director. Emily, good to see you. And then we have Lisa Vincent. She's a College Relations Specialist. Both with Fresno City <laughs> College, basically, right? Yeah. Welcome to the show, yes. ladies. Happy Monday to you. This is the first time in 30 years that you've had an open house for the entire community, yeah. correct? Why did you decide to do that? We've had kind of versions of an open house event throughout mm -hmm. the years, so we've definitely brought on students onto our campus to come see what we have, look at our programs and that kind of thing. But it was always offered during the day, you mm -hmm. know, on a weekday. And okay. so we really wanted this to be an event where the whole community could come. You could bring your whole family. We have a lot of adult learners. And so for adult learners, you know, you want to be able to have something that they could go to on a weekend or during the evening. So yeah. this was important for us to move it to a Saturday, have it be called a big open house, and just let everybody know it's for anyone that yeah. wants to come. And you're kind of making it, it making it into a big party, aren't you, Lisa? <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. So part of the event is actually, you know, educational, but mm -hmm. the other part is just fun. I mean, we have mm -hmm. Eight different food trucks. We've got entertainment, including an alumni, Patrick Contreras, vir, you know, oh, violin oh, virtuoso. Oh, yeah, yes. he's an alumni of Fresno mm -hmm. City. Oh, wow. And he's um, going to be performing at He what is time? at noon that okay. day. Where at? Um, on our uh, free speech area, got which it. is kind of the hub in the middle of campus. Okay. Um, so, food trucks, prizes, swag bags to the first 100 in attendance, mm -hmm. um, free tickets to the football game that day. Um, yeah, so part of it's a lot of fun for the whole family. Yeah. So that'd be a you know purpose purposeful mm -hmm. to come down for just that. But obviously the goal here is to maybe not introduce people to Fresno City College because we mm -hmm. all know it's there, but to show them and show the community what you have to offer, correct? Yeah. Yeah. So Absolutely. let's talk a little bit about that because um, a lot of people may think, well, Fresno City is just for you know high school uh, kids that graduate. So for the first two years, you go to Fresno City and then you move on. Mm -hmm. But you offer so much more, don't you, Emily? Yes, we have amazing career technical programs, mm -hmm. um, professional development if you already kind of are in a career you can go back for extra training um, I mean there's there's so many programs that we have we we serve over 30,000 students yeah there is literally something for everyone at uh, Fresno City uh, so and and at this event there is going to be something for everyone yeah, so no matter yeah. what program you might be interested in even if you want to take one class yeah. you're gonna be able to learn about that program how to get into it there's so many hands-on demonstrations there's a lot that people actually get to sit and see it's not just something like where you read a brochure. I yeah. mean, it's like we're going to have the college come alive for yeah. people. It's going to be like a hands-on kind oh, absolutely. of experience as well with, with a dream center. What Are you going to be uh, um, kind of showcasing the, the dream center as well as student clubs, mm -hmm. student services, the Veterans Resource Center? I'm curious, though, what is the dream center? So the Dream Center is for any of our AB 540 students, any of our migrant students that might need help, you know, navigating um, the Dream Act and how they can fund their education. Okay. Mm -hmm. They help students with that, and wow. so it's really important for our community. That Dream Center is so important. We're one of the very, you know, few colleges, especially community colleges, that has a dedicated center to serving those students. Wow, wow that's fantastic! So, yeah, so to much come. to offer, Lisa. That's for sure. Okay, so give us the details. It's an all all day event? It is. It, well, it's from 10 to 2. Okay. So there's no start and end time. You can come at any time during that. But you might want to come for the whole entire time because there's mm -hmm. so many things going yeah. on. So, for example, um, our applied technology department is going to have demonstrations in the construction department and photography and air conditioning, heating repair and mechanics and welding and wow. tours of that department. So if you're a real hands-on kind of person, you can come and see what that department has to offer. Mm -hmm. um, health sciences, so if you're interested in our nursing department, radiology tech, uh, respiratory therapy, dental uh -huh. hygiene, mm -hmm. medical assistant, tours and orientations um, in that department as well. Businesses having workshops, wow. Um, wow, so student much. poetry readings, art shows, photography shows, so Will lots to do. Learn potential about. students be able to register? 
we'll once give them they're the, there. We'll give them the information about okay. how they can apply, um, how they can, because there's not registration happening right now, okay, but um, the, the registration period's coming up. Okay. So we'll be able to, we'll have all of our outreach staff on hand. They can mm -hmm. give them all the information about how they apply and how they enroll. So oh, that's great. They'll be able to get all that info. Well, it sounds like a wonderful event. I really yeah, encourage really everyone good. to go, especially, especially if you have kids in high school that mm -hmm. maybe are wondering where to go to college. Anyway, Saturday, October 13th from 10 until 2 there at Fresno City. It's going to be a lot of fun. And ladies, I thank you for being here and telling us all about it. Thank okay. you. Thanks for having us. Coming up, how to rock your natural curly hair without frizz.